Hi, I'm Pam Roller. I've had MS since 2002. Well, that's when I was first diagnosed. And at the time I worked for the FBI, I had a wonderful legal position. I worked as a paralegal, but I was a practicing attorney before that. I was in the Army Reserves and I could still manage to do everything that I had done previously because MS didn't really get bad until 2009 and that's when I had a major relapse. And when I had a major relapse, it put me in the hospital for a week. Then I started walking with a cane and things went downhill. So when we moved down to Florida because the warm weather helped me and we found special equestrians. They had an opening for me on Wednesday mornings after I moved down here and so I fit right in. The people that help out at special equestrians, from the volunteers to the leaders of the horses to the instructors, are the most amazing people I think I've ever met in my life. I would like to thank Diane because she is the most amazing instructor that I've ever had. And I've had a couple few that have helped me with riding the horse, but she really teaches me how to ride, how to ride correctly. She, if I'm not sitting up straight, she doesn't look at me and go, oh, you're having a bad day, I understand. Sit up, put your shoulders back, put your chest out, sit up. I mean, it really helps. It helps physically and she's just amazing. She tries really hard to do everything and sometimes I have to pull her back because she'll go way forward, maybe past where she should. I have to tell her, take it easy, come on back down. And, and working with her that way. She's been phenomenal. Lynn is Wishy's leader, and she is just an amazing person. We are friends, not just here, but even outside on Facebook. She checks up on me, sees how I'm doing. If I'm off for a few weeks when I had surgery, I was off for six weeks, and she kept checking on me to see how I was doing. So she has that personal touch and she's just an amazing person and she gives so much of herself. She's just such an inspiration to me um, because of everything she goes through and she never complains. She's always got a smile on her face. She's always putting her best foot forward to do her very best. And I know she must be in excruciating pain many, many times and she just never lets on. I've made friends down here. The emotional support is just overwhelming but physically is where I really need help. And riding the different ways and learning the different things about riding has really built up my core strength. It's built up my body strength. It, it, it's just amazing. It gives the volunteers an opportunity to work with people that are disabled so they can relate to disabled people a lot better. And that way they can serve people in the community better than they could have before. The disabled people are able to get out and do so much more than they could before. But people do need your help and support, and that's why it's very important that you do support Special Equestrians in what they do. It's a wonderful organization.